Question 5, Gareth Bennett. Yeah, what assessment has the Welsh Government made of nitrogen dioxide levels along the A470 corridor in South Wales Central? Uh, so with nitrogen dioxide levels have been monitored before and after the initial implementation of that 50 mile per hour speed limit. Findings will be monitored <coughs> and reported before the end of this month, when a full 12 months worth of post-implementation -implementa data will have been collated and analysed. Uh, thanks. Thank you for the answer. And of course, um, there are major concerns over the amount of pollution emanating from the A470. I was uh, listening to your answer earlier to Susie Davis's question, which was re a related one, although hers was about the M4. Now, you say there's compelling evidence. We can have a look at that, of course. The observation of many of my constituents who regularly use that road to commute is that they're seeing um, an increased um, occurrence of traffic jams and, of course, there is the danger that traffic jams could tend to worsen the amount of polluting toxins in the air. So when you do monitor um, the evidence that arises, if it transpires that the, the situation has worsened, would you be of a mind to consider possibly removing the 50 mile per hour zones? Uh, well, so we will certainly monitor the position uh, very closely. The evidence is that 50 mile an hour zones, when properly preserved, prevent queues rather than add uh, to them. And the section of the A470 between Upper Boat and Bridge Street uh, interchange is an area where we know that the figures demonstrate that there is an urgent and immediate need to bring about improvements in air quality. Uh, we will do more over this autumn to put up information that explains to people why they, be, why they are being asked to observe that 50 mile an hour speed limit and to explain to them that they are being asked to do it because the scientific evidence demonstrates that they will be making a contribution to improving air quality for those communities that they are driving uh, through. Uh, I think we've always been able to make an appeal to people in Wales to understand that collective effort has an impact on the lives of other people. We haven't explained that well enough and persistently enough to people so far. Uh, I am optimistic that when we do that, we will see people observe that 50 mile an hour speed limit and that it will both improve air quality and reduce uh, queuing and do good in the lives of people who today suffer the impact of the actions that other people take in travelling through those communities. Question, where... Question 6, 